Number six on our list is also a beneficiary of strong family ties. Like his two older brothers, he scored over 1,000 points in his basketball career as he surpassed brothers and former teammates to become Elida's all-time leading scorer. Dakota Mathias, Elida, class of 2014 basketball. Elida's all-time leading scorer, twice Western Buckeye League Player of the Year, as well as two times First Team All-Ohio. As a senior, averaged 28 points, 8 rebounds, and 6 assists per game en route to the D2 Player of the Year and First Team All-State accolades. Helped lead the Bulldogs to the 2012 State Tournament, where they finished as state runners-up. Yeah, I think the whole progression of Mathias Brothers did filter down a lot of knowledge and know-how and more intangibles to Dakota because when he got to high school, he was as polished and confident as any player really I can remember. Well, I think Dakota Mathias was one of the smartest basketball players I've ever seen. He saw things on the floor before they developed, and that came from being around an athletic family. His father was a coach as well. But I had heard the stories about Dakota. The best was yet to come. Uh, from a Matthias, and then uh, hearing about all of the, uh, the games that were going on in the, Mathi in the Matthias house uh, with the indoor gym, and then the stories in eighth grade and how good this kid was really going to be, and, and boy, it sure turned out to be true. Dakota's a good high school player that I've seen in this area. Uh, he, he obviously shot the ball extremely well, but as he got older, his game just really developed, and uh, he, he always wanted, to, you know, he made the smart play. He didn't make the play that was just best for himself. He made the best play for his team, and, you know, he put on a show against us, I know, his senior year, and, uh, you know, he's one of those guys that it was just a privilege to watch him play. There are very few weaknesses in Dakota Mathias's game. One thing about his game that that always stuck in my mind was his toughness with handling the basketball especially early in his career I want to say his sophomore year in the state finals against Dayton Dunbar his ability to handle the ball and keep his head up and make the right decisions under that sort of pressure in front of a big crowd always struck in my mind that this cat Dakota Mathias is extra special. It, it's funny because that year they made it to state he was a sophomore Reggie McAdams was a senior and you know it was apparent that Reggie was the, the main go-to guy but I remember thinking at that state tournament that really Dakota was the guy that had impressed me so much and we saw him really blossom as a scorer once Reggie left but you know that that team Elida had he and Reggie formed such a great combo that they nearly won that state title against a team that had you know, a lot more athletic talent than them. But again, Dakota's leadership and ability to thrive and perform under pressure really, to me, was highlighted in that state tournament run. Sees the floor so well. Uh, I remember him as a sophomore uh, with Reggie McAdams as a senior and oh so close to winning that state championship versus Dayton Dunbar. But Dakota Mathias, uh, the, the best thing I could say about Dakota Mathias is he makes his teammates better. He also elevated his teammates. And to me in basketball, if you can bring the team along with you, that is even more of a tribute than scoring totals and assist totals. Dakota Mathias, the pressure was on for him to be good, and he came through, and he was just more than good. He was one of the best ever. Mathias has seen regular playing time the last two seasons for the Purdue Boilermakers. Dakota Mathias, number six on 44's top 44 male athletes. Mathias appeared in all 35 Boilermaker games this past season, and his assist to turnover ratio 3.9 is the second highest in Purdue program history.